any type of award that you receive is actually a recognition of your service to the organization. Uh, the fact that you are not in any way paid for service and you see yourself adding value to people is rewarding. And that's why you see so many professionals in the African region are so much into value creation and value addition. And SP offers them a platform to be able to showcase their ability to serve and develop others. Members should be able to identify among themselves who is it that needed to be rewarded for technical competence, dedication to serve others, and add value in a collective manner to SPE as an organization. Yes, I agree with you. And that will spur others to be able to again it's not competition, but cooperation indirectly, whereby you try to motivate others and others will see the motivation and benefit others along the line. I call it mutuality of interest. If I'm able to nominate you and you get recognized, is what we call uh, net backing. I receive the benefit for identifying you and then you're getting the award. Indirectly, I'm getting the award for the region, I think we've done well, both at the region level and the international level when it comes to service award. What I want us to work hard towards is to get a competent workforce in Africa to be considered for technical award. And that requires proper packaging without necessarily lying. So we need to identify among us those that we want to showcase when speaking technically in the oil and gas business. And Africa has been up there, but just that we have not been able to nominate people appropriately for consideration for the technical award. And that is our determination going forward. The next five years, we want to see many technically capable members of SP in African region getting technical award at the international level.